Hi everybody, in this video, we got another lost ring. Stay tuned, I'll tell you all about it. All right, I got a call from Charlie here, said he lost a ring. Charlie, how'd you get my name? Well, I googled uh, ringfinder.com and I saw <laughs> saw Steve the uh, gig master on YouTube. Awesome! And I he's highly qualified for the job and I've already <laughs> tried three days to find it and I can't find it, bought a metal detector. Still couldn't find it, so oh I, had, my goodness. I had to call for professional help, so <laughs> I'm, look, I'm looking forward to it. Well, you hear Charlie, you know, if you lose a ring, the ringfinders.com, you can find somebody local in your area that can uh, come out and help you look. And uh, Charlie found me on online and called me up, and what happened, he said he was playing with his dog in the snow, which was a couple weeks ago, so it's been a couple weeks since he lost it. Yep. And the snow was on the ground. Snow melted, you figure you just come right here and pick it up, right? Yeah. <laughs> Not so much. Not so much. <laughs> so uh, the snow melted. Charlie couldn't find it. So I actually went out and bought a detector. Yeah. Still couldn't find it. And we may not either, Charlie. I'm not guaranteeing anything <laughs> here now, but we're going to give it a try right now. Let's get our stuff out and get to work. Here we go. All right, Charlie's actually marked off the yard with some flags where he feels like it could be when he threw it. The white flag is the area he was really concentrating in. So anyway, we're going to check this out here. Uh, we're actually going to use the dais today, and uh, we're going to set it up. So we, I'm going to cut it on and set the sensitivity up really low because we don't want to dig deep in here. So let's go ahead and get the detector on and set it up. All right, my machine's going crazy. I just asked Charlie did he have a dog fence in the yard, but sometimes the interference from that will do that. And he said he did, and I'm asking him can he cut the fence off. Let's see, uh, let's see if it quiets down when the fence goes off because that it's going nuts right now. Oh my God, he must have just cut it off. I mean, all the noise went completely away. Unbelievable how much that fence was affected. I just happened to think, do you have a dog fence? And sure enough, when he cut it off, all the racket was gone. All right, we can get to work now. Oh, we're not really concerned with going deep, so we're actually gonna cut the sensitivity down on this. I'm using the beach mode, actually, because I'm more familiar with it. But I'm gonna cut the sensitivity down to about 75. And we're gonna go with that right there. And I think we should be uh, should be good to go now. All right, let's start looking. Here we go. All right, there's not a lot of targets in the yard. Once I lower the sensitivity on here, he cut the dog fence off. I've only had like two good targets, and look at this. Yeah. So I was thinking gold, but it is titanium. Look at this. 52 right there, baby. And it's nice and loud. Let's see what we got here. Charlie had to leave to take his daughter to school, so he's not around right now, but this is a really good signal right here. All right, stay tuned. We'll see if we can find it. Hi, everybody. I see something shining down here. Check it out. Look at that right there. Let me get the camera off here and check it out here. Ready? Let's get down here and look at that. There it is, right there, in the grass, right there. I'm gonna take a picture of that real quick. Awesome! I love seeing gold or platinum in the grass, right there, baby. All right, Charlie's gone, but we'll catch up with him when he gets back and give him his ring. Stay tuned. All right, Charlie's gonna be back in a little bit. I'm gonna leave the ring on my finger and tell him we got a good signal in the yard. I'll be playing with it like I'm looking for it. See how long it takes him to recognize it on my finger. Y'all ready? Let's do it. Here we go. Charlie, ready to pull this thing out of the ground? Yeah, I'm ready to pull it out. All right, let's go ahead and see if we can't find this thing right out here. Charlie marked off all the areas they had where it should be at. So we can go ahead right now and see if we can find it. Are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> I, mean, I'm, I can't wait to see where it is. All right, I want you to look real close right in this area right here. All right, I want you to look, are you looking close? You see anything? Charlie, you see anything in that area right there? No. You don't see anything right there? I see something on your finger. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Charlie? Is that it? That's it. Bam! Pull that thing off there and see if that's if it fits your finger right. I think it'll come off. Yeah, pull it on off. It'll come off. There you go. Is that the one? That's the one. Awesome, buddy. We Thank got you. it, man. So where All did right. you find it? Uh, it was over here, not too far from over in that area where you were looking at that second flag back there. So anyway, we got a recovery. Hey. Awesome! I right, appreciate everybody coming along. Don't forget to click like, comment below, share. Subscribe to the Gigmaster.
We'll see you on the next Ring Recovery. Stay tuned.